So guys, for the first step, you want to head over to search and type in display settings. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to scroll down and then you want to set your scale to 100% and make sure that you're on the recommended resolution for your monitor. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and type in device manager. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to expand display adapters. Then you want to right click on your graphics card and click on update driver. And then click on search automatically for drivers. Make sure that the best drivers for your device have been installed. Your graphics card also might come with a software that will allow you to install the latest drivers for it. So I have an NVIDIA graphics card. If you have one as well, you can download GeForce Experience and then head over to drivers and then click on check for updates. It will be the same if you have an AMD or Intel graphics card. You could just head over to the manufacturer's website and then download the software for it. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and type in registry editor. Click on it and then click on yes. Now once you're on this, you can follow everything I'll be doing up here. So first you want to expand HKEY current user. Then you want to expand control panel. Then you want to click on desktop. Now once you're in the desktop folder, you want to scroll down here and then you want to find Win8 DPI scaling. You want to double click on this and then change the value data to one and then click on okay. Now you want to click on any blank space, click on new and then click on dy32 bit value. Then you want to rename this as log pixels. Make sure that you put a capital L and capital P like I was showing in the video. Then you want to double click on log pixels and then change the value data to 78 and then click on OK. Now you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.